Hi guys, I'm about to install temporary electrical pole, 200 of them, for the future uh, house that I'm about to build on this lot. I am not an electrician nor have any experience with electrical uh, stuff, but I'm going to try to do this myself mostly and hire electrician to make the connections and also uh, pull the permits. So I don't know where it's going to take me or I may fail in process, but I'm gonna try. I'm gonna just give it a try and enjoy uh, the process itself. So here we go. When I was little, I used to watch a lot of Western movies, the cool cowboys. But it was not just the, the cowboys. It was more of the pioneers who really inspired me. They walked and drove their station wagons across the Great Plain into the Wild West. 
And then they build their homes and making something from literally nothing. I just had to experience that for myself. The United States today is just way too comfortable. Not just for me, but for the most. All we have to do is pick up the phone, call somebody, and they come and fix everything for you. Or build everything for you. We are living in a comfort zone. You know how it is. Everything is so easy and convenient. But to me, life isn't really worth living without the struggles, challenges, and the sense of achievements here and there. That's why I uh, see the United States as a young country, still in need of pioneers, and I decide to become a pioneer myself. I really admire their spirit of perseverance and resilience, and um, I want to be part of that also. I don't just want to talk about it, but I want to put my thoughts into action before my time's over. Starting this adventure, I thought it may be beneficial for both myself and others to share my experience, of course unforeseen, which I don't even know how it will turn out. And I want to share this especially with my son and my daughter and their friends. I hope to show them that life is all about taking risks, stepping out of the comfort zone and making something of yourself, or at least try to. I don't know how my thoughts will turn out, but um, I will just try. Just simply try. The supply store gave me wrong cable. Uh, I asked for number six copper or number four aluminium SCR cable, but unfortunately they gave me four wire instead of three wire. And they were nice enough to uh, give me the replacement. Um, but one of the electrician actually suggests that I use thicker cable, which is number two. Um, number two cable, three wire, for 200 amp service. So that's what I'm going to try.
can run. So putting all the parts together for the project has taken me way longer than I thought it would. I haven't done it yet, but uh, digging a hole and standing up a 20 foot heavy 6x6 pole is no walk in the park, I'm sure. I checked with the local companies in Washington DC metro area and they don't do this type of work. Only a few companies offered to give me uh, quotes and uh, they were unreasonably expensive. I know I don't have any fancy skills like professionals do, but I've got plenty of working muscle. Of course, for critical parts of the work, that's when I will call the professionals and get their help. I'm planning to start building my home slash workshop this year and uh, I'm going to do most of the work myself in a similar fashion. My son and my daughter and her husband, whenever they have time, they can help. I'm going to spend about half of each week on the most tedious and uh, time consuming work myself. We will only hire professionals for critical important parts of the building. It's going to be a unique and interesting project, so if you are into that kind of thing, please subscribe and click the like button. This eye vault was a bit confusing for me. Uh, the manual actually calls for an eye vault to drill through all the way, 6 inch and um, it mentions about porcelain eye vault but unfortunately all the local stores they don't sell the one that is long enough to drill all the way through a six inch and press screw on the opposite side this video is getting quite long uh, longer than i thought uh, so i'm going to cut it here and uh, make a second part of standing it up and making final connections and hope to see you soon.